Unify Layer 3 Adoption Methods In order for the Unify controller to discover and adopt Unify devices over Layer 3 network boundaries, each device must be configured with updated Inform URL settings. To review, the Inform URL represents the network address of the Unify controller and can therefore point to any reachable network address belonging to the controller, including IP address, host name, or even a fully qualified domain name. There are four methods for updating a Unify device's Inform URL for the purpose of remote management, including Unify Discovery Tool, SSH Client, DHCP Option 43, and DNS Resolution. The Unify Controller Server Software Package comes bundled with the Unify Discovery Tool for finding and managing Unify devices on the local network and can be used to update their Inform URL to the IP of the Layer 3 Unify Controller. Alternatively, any SSH client like Terminal or Putty can be used to connect to a Unify device, then update its Inform URL to the Layer 3 IP of the Unify controller via the setInform command. In addition to offering an IP address, gateway, and DNS settings, a DHCP server can also share the IP address of the Unify controller to Unify devices via DHCP Option 43 configuration whereupon the DHCP server listens for the vendor class identifier, UBNT, in the client DHCP lease request. Conveniently, Ubiquity DHCP server devices, such as Edge Router and Unify Security Gateways, can be configured with Option 43 to include the Layer 3 IP of the Unify controller in the DHCP lease. Finally, because the default inform URL includes the hostname Unify, the network DNS server can also be configured to resolve hostname Unify to the Layer 3 IP of the Unify controller. Among the four methods for updating a Unify device's Inform URL, DHCP Option 43 and DNS Resolution trigger auto-discovery for adoption in mass and therefore are very useful for large-scale deployments.